guys. This lesson is to help you get faster and better at blending with your short vowels in your three letter words. Okay, so we're going to look at this list of words and we're going to practice this skill so that you can blend faster and more efficiently. Okay, so what some of us are doing is what we learned in kindergarten and we're saying each sound separately. So let's look at the top one. P a k, p a k. That's their sounds, right? But in first grade, what we're going for, our goal, is to be able to look at this word and go, p a k, and not stop our breath through the whole word. Okay. So, uh, some of what's been happening that I'm hearing some of you do is this: you go p a k, p. -a -k. Ock. Okay, so then you're getting two parts. We want to put it all three together. Pock. All together. And then it gets faster. Pock. Okay. Also, we need to remember that there's only three letters here. So there's no other vowel. So there's no way this vowel, this is saying O. Oh. There's no way it's making its long sounds. It can only make its short sounds because there's no other vowel. There's no silent E at the end or another vowel with it. So it's always going to be a, e, i, a, a, just like our song about the short vowels. So we're never going to be saying poke. It's always going to be pock. All right, let's go through the list together, you and me, okay? Pock. Good. Next one. Rem. Good. Boz. Good. Gub. Good. Cax. Good. Din. Good. Tess. Now see, I almost put a stop in between the t and the e. Eh. We don't want to say t, s, t, s. We want to say Tess, all together, Tess. All right, good job. So um, I'm going to predict that every once in a while we had something like this happening. Ream. So think to yourself, why isn't that correct? What have we already said in this lesson? Why is that not ream? Yeah, because it has to be eh, short, ah, eh, eh, ah, ah, like we learned. Rem. Okay. Also, I'm going to predict that one or two of you out there have said jub, jub here. So think to yourself, why is that not correct? Right. Because this letter, occasionally G can say j. Occasionally, if it's with a I or an E, like in the word giraffe. But in our short three-letter words, we're always going to use our hard sounds. So we're going to say G, which is G's main sound. G, Gub. Same with this one. What other sound can C make? Right, it usually says K, but sometimes it says S, right, like in CC, who's in our class, right? But its main sound is K, and so we say K, X. All right, great job. Let's go over them one more time even faster. Pock. Rem. Foz. Gub. Cax. Din. Tess. Awesome job. These are obviously silly words, but you're going to use this skill and your words that are real in your reading, and I'm really proud of you. Good job. Boom shakalaka.